And now high knees, get those knees up. Four minute rounds. So I'll do three exercises back to back to back for reps. You're gonna do your reps and we're gonna go four minutes straight. You're gonna get through those three exercises as many times as you can in the four minutes. And then we'll do another set, then we'll do another set, and then we'll do them all over again. Okay, so the first three exercises in this first set, we're gonna focus on chest. So we're gonna start with a chest press. So just down and push them up like that, and then you're gonna do chest flies to open up, and then bring them back together, open up, bring them back together, and then push-ups, regular push-ups. Each one of those exercises for 12 reps, and you have four minutes to get in as many times as you can each of those exercises, All right? So chest press, chest fly, and push-ups, 12, 12, 12, four minutes. Grab your weights, get ready to go. Ready, set, and go for it. So the chest press, 12 reps. If you wanna do the hollow hold or leg hold with it to make it a little bit more difficult, you can. That's up to you. After the chest press, you're gonna go right into a chest fly for another 12 reps. After the chest flies, after your 12 chest flies, you got 12 push-ups. Just regular style push-ups. From your toes or from your knees. So after the chest fly, right into your push-ups. 12 reps. Make sure every push-up counts. Whether you're on your toes or on your knees, you want to get as deep as you can. And then once you're done your push-ups, right back to the chest press. Another 12. Everything's 12. After the push-ups, you go right back to the beginning to the chest press. Looking good, looking good. Should be able to get three rounds in, three times through each exercise, or pretty close to it. So the chest press after your push-ups and then right into your flies. Chest flies for 12. And then another set of push-ups after those chest flies. We're halfway done. Two minutes in, two more to go.
should be starting to become a little bit of a struggle now. Second round of those push-ups. Much more difficult than that first time through. Everyone's looking good though, working hard. That's what I like to see. You have one more minute now, one more minute in this round. Remember the goal is three times through each exercise. See how close you can get to that goal this round. Don't worry, you'll have another chance to do it. <laughs> 30 seconds now. Last 10, couple more reps, this last 10 seconds. All right, you can take your break, water break. So I'll show you the next three exercises for this next round. We're gonna do a narrow grip chest press, so the hex press, so the dumbbells together, put them nice and tight together, down to your chest, and then back up. Keep your elbows tight to your body. So you're gonna do 12 of those, and then skull crushers, like that. 12 skull crushers, and then we're gonna do up, up, down, down. So on your forearms, and you're gonna go up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down. 12 of those, lead with each arm six times, right? So lead with the one arm for six, and then lead with the other arm for six. So each of those again, 12 reps, narrow grip, chest press, skull crushers, up, up, down, down. All right, 12 each, four minutes again. Ready, set, and go for it. Narrow grip, keep those dumbbells tight together, squeeze them together. So you have to squeeze your chest, contract your chest. And then you're gonna go from there right into skull crushers for 12 more reps. Today is gonna hurt. All week is gonna hurt. So after the narrow grip chest press, you have skull crushers laying down on the ground and just bend and then extend, bend and extend. 12 skull crushers and then up, up, down, down. Remember the up, up, down, down, you're gonna do 12 total, but I want you to lead with each arm for six, so you even it out. So you start on your forearms and you're just gonna push up, up, down, down. You can do that from your toes or from your knees, whatever you can handle. This round, the goal is to get through each exercise twice and into the third round, but not totally completed. We're halfway in, two minutes and two more to go.
Push through, push through. See if you can complete each exercise twice. And into that third round. You have one more minute. One more minute in this round. Working all the way to the end. exercises the next three so the first one you just need one dumbbell we're gonna do the overhead tricep extensions one dumbbell two hands so down all the way and then extend it up keep those elbows tight to your face don't let them flare out keep them in so you're gonna do those for 12 and then dips if you have a chair or a bench or somewhere you can use that or you can do it on the floor I'll show you you want to keep your hands close to your butt if you're on a chair and keep your butt close to the chair and just bend and push, bend and push like that. You can do these on the floor though if you need to, if you want to. Just have your butt off the ground, bend it and push. Try to hit your butt down to the ground and get as much range as you can. You're going to do 12 of those, 12 dips and then bicycles for the abs, 30 bicycles. So overhead extensions for 12, dips for 12, bicycles for 30. All right. Here we go, overhead extension. Just one dumbbell, ready, set, and go for it. One dumbbell, two hands, 12 times. Get as much of a stretch at the bottom and then extend at the top, really stretch it out though at the bottom, make it a struggle. After those, you have dips, dips on the floor or on a chair or whatever you got for 12 reps. And then after your 12 dips, you have 30 bicycles, bicycles for the abs. We'll give the upper body a little break. Do I use this one? That was probably good. Or that one, that one will be good too. So 12 dips and then 30 bicycles. And then right back to the overhead extension. So you should be able to get through each of these twice for sure. And a little bit into the third round. Maybe completing the dips three times and maybe not the bicycles. But two times for sure. That's two minutes down, two more to go. Two minutes left.
Working hard, struggling. That's what I like to see. You got one more minute now. One minute left. Two times through, get through those two times through and into that third round. Thirty seconds. Push through now. How far can you get? Oh. Did Vanessa tell you it's her birthday today? My birthday. <laughs> Last ten. Ten seconds. Finish off whatever you can do right now. All right, let's get a little break, water break. So now we'll go back through each of those. We'll go back to that first round. I'll just remind you what we did that first round. The chest press for 12 reps, and then chest flies for 12, and then push-ups, regular push-ups for 12. So chest press, chest fly, and push-ups, 12, 12, 12. Same thing, four minutes. But now, if you remember how far you got last time, you wanna to try to get at least that far or more this time. Not less. <laughs> All right, so we're going 10 seconds, starting with the chest press. Okay, ready, set, and go for it. Chest press, 12 reps. chest flies for 12 open up wide stop just before the arms hit the ground feel that stretch as much as you can at the bottom and once you're done your chest flies then you've got your push-ups just regular style push-ups for 12 last time, how far you got last time, that should be your goal in your head right now. That's how far you want to get and maybe push a little bit more, a little bit, a few more reps. exercises. Everybody's on pace to finish these exercises, each one twice. 
and into the third round. That's the goal. That was the goal last time. Three times through. One more. One more minute now. Last 30, let's go, 30 seconds. <laughs> Not that low on the push-ups. <laughs> 15, keep going, 15 seconds. Come on, how many more reps can you get? Come on. No, it's tough when Tracy's on her knees for those push-ups. All right, take your break. One minute break. All right, so the next set I'll show you, just to remind you again. So we have the narrow grip, the narrow grip press, so dumbbells together. And then we go into the skull crushers that so narrow grip skull crushers 12 each and then then the up up down down from your forearms up up down down up up down down leading with each arm for six reps or 12 total all right so have about 15 seconds on the break All right, here we go. Narrow grip, chest press first. Ready, set, and go for it. Keep those dumbbells locked together. Squeeze them together so you contract your chest and keep it engaged the entire 12 reps. So after those, the chest press, narrow grip chest press, you have skull crushers for another 12 reps. Big bend, big stretch as you come down with those dumbbells. Stretch your triceps and then extend. And then after the skull crushers, it's the up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down. 12 reps total, leading with each arm for six reps. Power those bodies up, the up, up, down, down. Power through. Those ones are tough, especially right now. Two minutes to go, two done, two to go. Keep it working, keep it going. 
two times through each exercise. You can do it. You can do it this time. If you didn't do it last time, this is the time to do it. One minute left. One more minute to get in as many more reps as you can. done this set then we just have one more and that is gonna hurt for two days okay take your break water break one minute break and we have one more set so the last set, we have, we're starting with this one, the overhead tricep extensions for 12, 12 reps. And then you have dips. So dips on the floor or on a bench or chair, whatever you have, for 12 reps. And then bicycles for 30 reps. So overhead extensions for 12, dips for 12, bicycles for 30, four minutes. And then we're done. We got 30 seconds still on the break. All right, so grab your dumbbell for those overhead extensions. 12 reps, ready, set, and go ahead. Over extension, 12 reps. Big stretch, remember range of motion, that's the most important. So if you need to lighten the load to get that good range of motion, the full range, then do that. But you wanna get full range no matter what. Don't cheat with heavy weights. And then 12 dips. Same thing, full range, as much range as you can get. You want to bend those elbows at about 90 degrees. <laughs> and then once you've completed your 12 dips, you have 30 bicycles. Remember, this is the last round, last one. So make it the best you can. Two minutes, two done, two to go. So now we're past halfway. Two times through each exercise. That's the goal this time. Should be able to do it. And should be able to get into the third round. Three rounds of at least into the dips for three times. If you're here. 
One more minute. Last minute now. One minute to get as far as you can. Get that second set of bicycles in. And then get into that third round. Thirty seconds. You still have time. So lots of time. <sighs> last ten. Last ten. Just a few more reps. Three more. Four more. Depending on what exercise you're doing. All right, that's good, all done. 